Hi, first off, two goals in two games for you. How does that feel? Feels good, you know. Um, you know, getting in the right spots, you know, having the composure to finish. Um, you know, I wish could have turned into six points. Um, but you know, you know, confidence for me yeah, going forward, whether I'm starting or coming off the bench, you know, the confidence to make a difference in the game. Big game coming up this weekend, LAFC rematch. What are you looking forward to the most on Sunday? Yeah, just revenge. Um, you know, it's tough all week. You know, even you're, before the San Jose game, you're talking about, you know, not looking past San Jose because, you know, you just have a bitter taste in your mouth from the last game, I think. You know, we were disappointed with how we played um, defensively, offensively, um, just, you know, kind of all around. It was it was far from, far, far from a good performance. So I think for us, just trying to, you know, learn from that um, while also not dwelling on it because we know we, we did a lot of things that were very uncharacteristic of, you know, how we normally play. What do you think is the single biggest thing you guys need to correct from last Sunday in order to play better this weekend? Yeah, I think, you know, they were able to find those pockets of space kind of, you know, behind our midfield line, um, you know, allowed them to get out way too easily. And I think for us, if we're able to kind of trap them and win the ball a little higher up the field, it sets up, you know, us well to, you know, not have to necessarily transition from our defensive third to get the ball, you know, to our attack in half. It's, you know, we're able to win the ball a little higher up the field. We're able to, you know, maybe one pass and all of a sudden you're in the final third. And I think for us, you know, that could be all the difference between, you know, sitting back and kind of, um, you know, defending for, for what seemed like a lot of last game. Sure. What did you see on the, your goal uh, against San Jose and uh, what's kind of going through your head when you see that ball coming in from Nico in the box there? Yeah, I think, um, you know, for us, just, you know, being down a goal still at that point, it was just trying to make an effort to get in the box, put myself in dangerous spots. Um, you know, I, I think for us, <laughs> when you need a goal, so you're going to take chances. Um, and it was a game where positionally you kind of, you know, it wasn't necessarily as disciplined as other games because you you know who you're playing against. So for me, just trying to, you know, beat a guy to a spot, and I knew it was kind of one for one, man for man. So for me, if I knew if I could get there in front of that guy, um, and, and you know, uh, Nico hit a good pass. I didn't even think when I was running, he saw me. Um, so for me, you know, I was in the right spot at the right time. Whenever you'd been pushing for minutes and trying to break back into the starting lineup, how do you guard against sort of pressing too much whenever you do get that opportunity to not try to just put everything on yourself right yeah, away? It's a good question. Um, it's tough. I think you know, you're, try you're trying to make a difference and show well, but I think, you know, for me, what I'm good at is not necessarily the flashy things. So I think for me, it's just doing right things consistently over and over and over. And then, you know, if you're in the right spaces, you know, enough, eventually you're going to get rewarded for it. So I think for me, you know, I trust in, you know, my ability to think through the game and, and think about, you know, just, you know, not thinking too much when the, when the ball does, you know, fall to my feet and not trying to press and, and make a play every time I get the ball. Uh, you guys, uh, the bench players have come in in the last couple of games and either steady things in LAFC or, or had an impact against uh, San Jose. So uh, how important has it been to your confidence to show that the players who aren't starting are getting some uh, some impact off the bench? Yeah, I think, you know, I think that was one of the things going into the season. We knew we had a deep team. Um, and, you know, it's, it's being tested right now with guys that are out injured. Um, you know... You know, the first, you know, four or five games we were super healthy, and you know that's not going to be the case for all 34 games. But, um, you know, you're trying to, you know, when you do come in, you, even if you get 10 minutes, you're trying to make a difference and show that, you know, if someone does go down or if, if circumstances happen where someone's out with the national team, you know, they can trust you to play more minutes. And I think, you know, whether it's been a veteran guy, a younger guy coming in off the bench, I think people have, you know, done a pretty good job.